Hi, I'm Tim Lineweber and I work for the Beatrice Water Department. The City of Beatrice and the Beatrice Water Department are asking for your help. As part of the EPA's revised lead and copper rule, all cities are required to determine if lead water pipes exist and create a plan to replace them. The city's water infrastructure does not contain lead, however your private line might. Your water service line connects the water main to the property. These pipes bring water into your house or building. They can be made out of copper, lead, galvanized steel, or plastic. In this video, I will walk you through how to find where your service line enters your home or business, and how to identify what material your line is made of. To find your line, you'll need to answer these questions. Number one, do you have a basement, crawl space, or a flat slab under your house or building? And number two, do you know where your service line enters the house or building? It would be where your water shutoff valve is located. If you happen to have a basement like we have here, your water line is going to come in probably on a lower end, bottom end of the basement. But if you have a crawl space or a slab, a flat concrete pad, your water line will probably come up somewhere in the middle of the floor possibly a utility room or a bathroom. So again, you'll be looking to identify where the pipe comes up and you have a shutoff valve located where that pipe would come through. That would be the pipe that we need identified for you folks to tell us what type of pipe it is. Now I'm gonna walk you through which kind of pipe you possibly have coming into your house or building. Here, we have a lead pipe which is a very large, about an inch around, soft material. If you take a key, you can take and almost scrape the coating off of this pipe here. So gray in color, very dense looking pipe. Here, we have a galvanized pipe. On a galvanized pipe, what we can do to prove galvanized, take a magnet again and sticks right to it. So if you have a lead or excuse me, a galvanized pipe coming in. See if you can find a magnet and stick it to the pipe. So again, very rusty looking sometimes. Also the uh, fittings screw together on a galvanized pipe. Over here we have a copper type pipe. Same color as a shiny penny. So over here, magnet, nothing, will not stick. So again, copper pipe is very similar to a shiny penny. And then lastly, we have plastic or PVC. We have three different colors represented here. If you have plastic coming into your house, you could possibly have a blue, a white, or a black plastic pipe coming in. So again, the way to do that would be to possibly take something and just lightly scratch it, tap on it, because you're gonna have a metal sound on the others versus plastic. Now, if some of you have painted walls and your pipe is painted, you may need to take and scrape a little bit of that paint off to determine what kind of pipe is servicing your house. Now send us your results by completing the survey on the city's website or completing the paper form that was mailed with your utility bill. If you attempted these steps and are still unsure which type of material your service line is made of, a city representative will visit your home to inspect your service line at no cost to you. To request an inspection, complete the material survey form and select yes on send a representative to verify. The city must collect this information from every home and business in the city. We appreciate your participation. If you have any questions, please call the Water Department at 402-228-5217. I hope this was helpful, and thank you.